Hello friends, this is Meme Gamer back to you with a new episode of Tomb Raider. Let's start a new game. Alright. Tomb Raider. Oh damn. That's how it starts. Oh, the graphics are so much better now. <laughs> you guys remember Tomb Raider Legend and Tomb Raider Anniversary were pretty old games, to be honest, and the graphics were really outdated, to be honest. But, finally, we have arrived at the last chapter of this trilogy, at least. And it's good to see better graphics. It's not like new generation graphics, but it's good enough. I love the presentation of this game. It starts with, with the entire main mansion exploding. Like, that's awesome. Really like it. Come on, Laura. Fast. One thing I don't like about this game, it's something that they never fixed in any of the, the games so far. Is the camera. The camera's really crazy. It moves all over the place. You don't have much control over it. It's really bad. Oh, don't get burned. Look out! It's not! I know! As I said, very cinematic, good presentation. One week earlier. Hello. Hey, Lara. Find it yet? Patient Zip. I warned you that conveniently undiscovered islands would be scarce in the Mediterranean. Are you sure this Eddington chap knows what he's talking about? If he says father was convinced the path to Avalon was here, I have no reason to doubt it. Fair enough. But it's... well, we've been talking... You've been talking, man. It's just... all right. Maybe Avalon is real, but just because some bad woman tells you you're... Mother didn't die after all. I mean, look, I, I don't want to seem heartless, but this, this idea of your mom living in some, some Celtic underworld, it's a, it's a little bit mental, isn't it? I have no illusions that my mother is holding court in some mythical paradise, Alistair. I only want the truth, whatever it may be. I'll ring you later. Okay, awesome. Um, so as a quick recap of the previous game. Um, so her mother died, uh, supposedly, um, after a, a plane crash. So Laura and her mother were stranded in, a line, in an island. And they found this ancient artifact, a uh, sword. And a portal opened up and her mother pulled the sword out of the rock and she had disappeared. So for years, Flora thought that her mother was dead until, until the recent events from Tomb Raider Legend, where she discovered that 
her mother was actually transported to a place called Avalon, and and now she, well, um, that's what her father thought all along before her father died. That's what he th thought, and he was discredited for that as a scientist because he believed in myths and um, other worlds being one of them, Avalon. And now Laura is on the trail to find the path to Avalon and we don't know yet what's gonna happen and why she's here but she got some clues from this guy who used to be her dad's friend I guess. I, I'm not I'm not really sure of everything that's going on in this game yet. Um, but yeah, that's a very quick recap and yeah. And the person who is actually disputing uh, against Laura to get to that place first is Amanda. Who used to be her friend, but they, during excavation in Peru, her friend almost died and every, everyone thought she had died. But she actually acquired a, an ancient, weird talisman that pretty much saved her and gave her special abilities, I guess. That's, that's what I, how you would call it, I think. Now this friend is totally nuts and wants to kill everybody. Um, and they don't get along anymore, so yeah, we'll see how that goes. Um, I'm pretty sure... wait, what am I supposed to do here again? I think... oh yeah. I don't know, to be honest. <laughs> I'm just turning the wheels here. That's as far as I remember. Keep turning the wheels and something's gonna happen eventually. Oh, I think I got it. There you go. It's actually amazing that this is the first game in the series where you have somewhat of an open world game. It's not totally open, but it's still very limited, but it looks massive. You know, you, you saw when I start diving down here. Okay. Um, <laughs> you, you, it, it feels like you could go anywhere, right? I, I'm pretty sure there's got to be a limit somewhere where you cannot go beyond past that part, but as far as we can see, it looks like as if you could go anywhere. Even though you don't, might not want to, because I, I don't want to, I like to follow some sort of, you know, a uh, regular path or predetermined path. I think it's more fun, I don't have to worry too much about where I'm going, just follow the clues. And those games have a lot of clues on where you have to go. Sometimes the walls are painted, painted diff differently, then you know you have to go through that wall or something like that. Okay, so what do we have here? Okay, so in this game you don't have a health pack, you have those... Yeah, you have health packs, but they, but they but they're different, they're not like... They look like a plate with food on it, or a bowl. So it's kind of interesting. And they've also upgraded her movement, so from what I remember in watching interviews about this game, they used um, like an athlete's movement, so they capture her movements, and that's why it looks better but worse at the same time. It looks more realistic, but at the same time it looks more staged, I would say. <laughs> um, so we have this. But man, it still looks really good. Um, and I keep saying this, keep saying that for the for these Tomb Raider games, it's because I I was used to playing these games on a PS3 back in I don't know when, you know, I think 2007. And now I'm playing on a PC with the max settings and it, oh, am I, am I am I going nowhere? Now I'm playing on a PC with max settings and upgraded graphics and everything. Oh, it's right there. I just saw it. And it looks so much better now. 
Oh, okay, I think I know where to go. So far, it's been hard to choose which one I, I liked more. Um, which one I like most. I've played Tomb Raider Legend and Anivers An Anniversary. And they're both so good. I'm like, damn, it's hard to choose which one is my favorite. But we'll see. We'll see who takes the second place after I played this one at least. Or the third place. Okay. Press to turn the utility light on and off. Okay. It's crazy how this game, or the Tomb Raider games, have a great support for controllers and... Um, if you play old games on the PC, you notice a lot of old games have a lot of compatibility issues with um, with old games, uh, the controller with the controller. So it's very oh, frustrating at times. I think that's it. Door number one opened. Incredible. The carvings are clearly similar to early Germanic design, but this is far older than the 5th century, yet, strangely enough, more sophisticated. Proto-Norse runes. Let's see. World of Mist. That would be Niflheim, the realm of the dead. Not Avalon exactly, but the Norse equivalent. So it is my understanding that um, this avalanche is looking for is from the from British myths, I think, or something Germanic myths, I think. I'm not so sure. If you know, let me know in the comments. And Niflheim would be the Norse equivalent, or she thinks it is. Um, and she believes that those myths they all relate to the same thing. Um, if you paid attention to the last game, there's a part where she talks about it with Zip and Alistair. Where she says that many cultures have different myths, but they all refer to the same things. So I guess that's that's what she's looking for, this Niflheim or Land of the Dead, Avalon, where she's going to find her mother. Okay. Got here. This gigantic octopus. Um, all right. There's also a DLC or two DLCs for this game, which I haven't played ever. So I think, I think they have been released to the PC. If so, I know that they were they were released for the Xbox, but if they were also released for the PC, I'll. I'll be sure to check them out and, and and record them too for you guys to, to see the story. Um. Uh oh. Hey. I wanna go there. Excuse me. Yeah, he 
is holding the mechanism. is already going crazy around here. Uh, okay, how do I go back up? Uh, oh, here. There's literally a path with walls or stones that are painted white for me to know. <laughs> and I'm here trying to figure it out. Oh, come on. See those... Um, white markings that's what they do in games like this so that you know the path you should go and her movements are better they look more realistic but less believable if that makes sense like in the context of the game it looks a bit a bit weird again and jump and try to open nothing happened huh why why nothing happened I want to know then I come here She's not. What? What's happening? Oh. Okay, so that's how it works. You need to pull that lever first, the one in the middle, and then, yeah, then come on, come this way. And I think that's it. I'm gonna drop that on on his head. Ooh. I guess so. I need to break the chain. Damn, Laura, you're ruthless. can open a door oh this that's that's what that's for <laughs> okay uh -huh. Thor, the Norse god of thunder. Whatever are you doing down here in Niflheim? 
According to the Eddas, Thor needed special iron gauntlets to wield his mighty hammer, Mjolnir. Could it be? Oh. I was like, what's happening? I think I need to put some weights on those two platforms. I need to find something heavy. No, this is not... This is not it. On the other side then, maybe. Ooh. Here. Heavy box. Press RB to throw. What is RB? I don't know. I'm not used to this controller. RB. Ah, there it is. It's the trigger that this that releases a grenade. Have brought some some shoes at least. She has so much technology. I bet she could. If she wanted to. Your hands on your head. Turn around slowly. I don't suppose you'd be open to bribery, would you? <laughs> they took it. Amanda Everett sends her regards. They should have killed her already. Instead of blowing up the place. Bloody hell. Bloody hell. Damn, Amanda. Amanda, actually, not Amanda. It's Amanda. Little devil. The little devil Amanda. 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 Where are you? Laura could have killed her in the, in the last game at the ending. But she didn't. And that's how she repays her? Huh. She's very ungrateful. Very ungrateful. Uh, I'm confused. they go. Oh. Perfect. Perfect. Can just swing across. 
How do I swing across? Perfect. Let's catch up, Laura. Let me get a health back first. See, nothing to worry about. They should have killed her. That's what I'm. That's what I'm saying. If you leave Laura Croft alive, having the chance to kill her, and you want to kill her, she's gonna come back at you. She's Laura Croft. She's a Tomb Raider. She can get out of tombs easily. Glitch. She doesn't have any more that double jump. Ah, oh, that's unfortunate. I like that. Okay. So glad she now has the, the breather thingy she can use. But she can stay underwater as long as I want. Okay, how do I get out? Oh, there's literally a door in there. Is that the place? No, that's where I came from, right? I don't... Oh, it's right here. It's not the door. The door is where I came from. So, there we go. She has no bullets. Oh. How? I thought she had lost her bullets. What happened? I just gave it back? <laughs> this place is confusing. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. I would be super tired, tired already from swimming, jumping, climbing, being hit on the head, <laughs> survived an explosion. She's like Nathan Drake uh, from Uncharted. Man, that's such a great game too. All the four games and uh, the DLC. But Uncharted, Nathan Drake is not as cool as Lara Croft, you know. There's my boat. And they should have destroyed my boat too. Another mistake they made. Like, remember what I said, how, how big this place is. Look, it looks massive, right? It might not be massive. You might find invisible walls pretty, pretty nearby. But it looks massive. I, I think that's what matters for a game such as this, where you're worried about... Not so much of exploration, but doing what you have to do in the story. Some more games should be like this. All right. than Lara. That is for sure. God of Thunder. Adrenaline. Okay. Oh, he didn't die. Shit. There's another one. Dead. You're all dead. Go! Danger. You be careful. I am dangerous. Oh, wait. 
Where are they? Oh, it's a sticky grenade. Perfect. Perfect. Why can't I get their weapons too? Combat is kind of ridiculous in this game. Oh, at least you can't aim. You can't aim two targets at the same time. So she lost some of her abilities while while uh, fighting, I think, because they tried to use a real person to animate her character, like a real athlete, and that, I mean, a real person cannot do the things that Laura Croft could do, so I guess kind of looks limited. And more of those. Helicopter. Nothing. Nothing that I want here. Uh, I'm going down again. Why? Oh, okay, if it's saving. Whenever you hear that that sound, bling, means it's saving, so it's probably that I'm on the right track. Shit, bug that. anything I'm back to where I was uh, I'm lost again oh man she doesn't have the double jump that I love see right here Some more health packs Shit, scared the hell out of me. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm wearing headphones and I'm like, oh. Shit. <laughs> okay, let me adjust my headset. What the hell? Close there she goes. Oh, there they go. Dead. Warning, use handrail. <laughs> Good try, good try. Damn, he's stupid. You don't shoot near flammable stuff. And she's done all this barefoot. Uh oh, evacuate ship. You don't have to say twice. Damn, it's too small. Only Lara can use it now. Until I kill her. Even that won't unbind the artifact. 
jar offers little in the way of amusement, so I've grown fond of watching Amanda suffer the effects of sharing your interests. Jacqueline Nutha, you just don't know when to die. <laughs> A trait we have in common. It was you who told Amanda about Avalon. Our time is short, so choose your questions carefully. What do you know about my mother? The day is you and she found in Nepal, Part of a travel network, so to speak. It took your mother to Avalon. My father thought Avalon was below, but that's Niflheim. What's the Norse connection? Ah, Richard found the wrong Norse underworld. Your mother didn't go to Niflheim. She went to Helheim. Where is it? I will tell you where it is one day. But when that day comes, you'll we'll need Thor's hammer to get inside. Perhaps you'll have better luck finding it than your father did. What do you mean? Your answer is on the west coast of Thailand. Send it in parallel. Okay, let's get the hell out of here, Laura. Uh, Alright, so remember I said that the first game, uh, Tomb Raider Anniversary, would be really important for this game. It is because Natalie is back, so that's why they remade that game, so that they could reintroduce her here. So Natalie is that character we met on the first game in Tomb Raider Anniversary, and now she's back. So she didn't die um, in the first game, she was just imprisoned, I guess, because in theory she can't die. Can't? I mean, there might be a way, but... Oh shit, almost died. Now she's back, and now they need Lara because um, she put the artifact on her hand, and I guess it kind of takes the shape of the person's hand. So they need Lara to get Taurus Hammer to open Helheim, I think. So Lara just found out, according to Natla, her father was looking for the wrong um, underworld, world, which he was looking for Niflheim. But her mother actually went to Helheim, which is another type of limited dead, I guess. And now we're gonna see what's gonna happen when she goes to Thailand. She have it. She has it back. See, it only works on her hand now. Now she needs to find Thor's hammer, I guess. According to Natla, Evalon and the Norse underworld of Helheim are one and the same. Entry is not possible without Mjolnir, the war hammer of the Norse god of thunder, Thor. Is this what my father was searching for in Thailand? Jungle shorts or jungle pants? I think. Shorts. More classic. Oh, submachine guns. Here's a bunch of nice weapons now. I mean, I guess the enemy is stronger this time. None of the ruins are visible from down here. But if Father did explore this site, I see no sign of it yet. I still don't see how Thailand is connected to Viking, or ruins under the Meta. Hell, even Avalon for that matter. Helheim, Zip. 
Various myths use different names, but they all apply to the same remnants of the ancient world. One of those remnants is still alive. I would hate to be Amanda if Natla ever gets free. I would hate to be any of us. Okay, so is Natla under some sort of prison? That's what I didn't understand. That's okay. Oh. Oh, sharks. Shit. Kill it, kill it. Before it kills you. Kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it. Man, this place is amazing. So pretty. Nice. I'm not gonna explore, I'm just gonna go straight to the the task ahead of us. But yeah. jump. That happens all the time. Okay. Let's go. Keep going. Up, 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 up. Oh, there it is. Jump. Spiders. Get off of me. Uh, where to now? Oh, just... okay. Found it. The blue bird! Let's... let's take a look around. Man, so pretty. Here's some tigers. Here they come. Oh, come on. Mm. Mm. Oh, here. Oh, okay. She can now jump repeatedly. Just like on Prince of Persia, but how does that work? Ah, oh, come on.
food. A bowl. Health pack. Shit. Ow. Leave me alone. Leave me the fuck alone. Ah. Catch a grenade, bitch. No, get out of here! You have a fucking grenade! Oh, <laughs> shit! <laughs> At least it worked. Oh, there's still one more. Ow. Die. There he goes. Bitch. Damn. I hate those animals in games. Usually so annoying. Mm. Oh, here. There she goes. She's like Prince of Persia now. Can jump from one wall to the other. Headshots can be triggered when the adrenaline meter is full. Headshots. To perform a headshot, hold LT to lock on. Get close and press X. Click X. I'll try that. No, it didn't work. Is my adrenaline full? I don't know. Ow. Ouch. Ouch. Man, the camera is horrible in this game. So bad. Shit, get out. The camera is so fucking bad. It's impossible to kill those things. No, it's not impossible. It's just really hard. Shit. We still didn't get the hang of this game. At least not the combat portion of it. Yeah, the camera is really bad. I wish they they had fixed the camera by now, but no. Just it's just the same as it's always been. Since I remember. Oh. Imagine killing spiders with a shot, with a, not a shotgun, with a semi-automatic. <laughs> That's crazy. Grab on it. Grab on it. She's not gonna do it. Why not? Grab. What? It's the same. The same height. The characters are Vedic Sanskrit. They're severely weathered. Bhagavati of the seventh. It must be referring to the capital of Patala, the lowest infernal world in Hindu tradition. It's a netherworld populated by snake people, although the enlightened one, Narada, spoke rather fondly of it. That's Shiva on top, and his mistress Kali is down below. Okay. 
Okay, so as you guys can see, there's another reference to um, some sort of hell. This time in Hindu tradition, I guess. Get off me. grab what she did fortunately come on go up I know you can hmm there's something on her hand you can see maybe it's something to shoot you can shoot in her hand maybe I don't know we'll see when we get there Might take a while because I don't remember what what to do in this part of the game. What have I done differently? Anything? Nope. Nope. And what? What is it? Oh, food. It's always always welcome. Try going to the other side. Oh, why would I want to go to the other side? Oh, it's very confusing. I can go through here, actually. Yeah. Side, other side, please. Good, good girl. Good girl. Okay, so I think I have to do the same thing here, right? But something is different here. What is it? Find a way to get down there, but how? I have two poles, but I don't know where to use them in reality. There's already one right here. Okay, let's see if she can give me a tip. Journal. Yes. No, not here. Field assistance. So I'm I need to find a way down to the bottom. Um. I should try that switch by the entrance to this area. Mm, a switch. There's a switch. Okay. I never saw any switch anywhere, to be honest.
Okay, so this happened. <laughs> uh, watch this again. I'm all the way down here. Ah, oh, it worked. See? Easy. Ooh, what's all this? Oh, lizards! Oh my god, those are gigantic lizards. Yeah, let, let go of me. There are too many. Run. Scammer in one move. I hate this camera. Ow. Camera doesn't move when I'm walking. You can look around. Gonna get stuck. Alright, nothing happened. Ooh, I can't move these. Hmm. What am I doing? I think I can move them around this circle. Okay. That's doing nothing. I thought that maybe I could put it against the sun and would would do something, but I guess not. this are probably signs of civilizations that are older than actually the I guess the civilization that's above it like the the Hindu civilization and the religion culture and stuff this must be the uh, this looks like the 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 architecture it looks like the last level from Tomb Raider anniversary where you have all that fire and lava yeah, I think that has to do with the civilization where Natla comes from, I guess. Makes more sense. Come on, camera. <laughs> oh my goodness, this camera is so bad, I can't see anything. <laughs> okay. This type of problem in, in, in big productions, like big games like this one, usually have to do with pressure to finish the game on a certain deadline. And these games, man, they take forever to make. And if you put like a, a deadline that's not enough time, it's you're gonna see a bunch of this stuff happening. Especially when you add so many more features to a game, like, like the nature and everything. Oh, what's all that? What's happening? Got the lizards again. Shit! I don't see you coming. I have no more health packs. Need to find one soon. There's gonna be at least one around here. Come on. Uh, nope. I think I saw one up there. Nope. Okay, I'll find one eventually. Oh, there's one right there. Okay, let me try to unpack everything that's going on. There's a lot of 
things to do here. Oh, no! That's not what I wanted. Go up. A lot of things going on. Um, I could go there, I could go up. Let me go up. Oh no, I cannot go up. Nope. So I guess I must open that door and it has that gate. There's actually two gates. I need to probably need to open the two gates. Okay. Come on. Go up. Anyone else? Hmm. Okay, all the way. An artifact, but nothing here. Nothing here, I think. Hmm. Oh, there's more food in there. That's always important. How do I get there? Like this. Easy. Easy, easy, easy. I wonder if I should try to get there, but uh, there's a platform right here. Good try. I'm not sure if she's gonna die if I try to jump. Okay. This is better. <laughs> oh, I'm just back here. Where I, back here. Oh man, this is kind of frustrating. I don't know where to go. This game is not as, as linear as I would hope it to be. Also because I don't remember. Once you know where to go, it's pretty easy. But I don't remember. I haven't played this game in a long time. Okay, I'm here. And now where do I go from here? Well... Okay. I can only go down, I guess. Right? That's what it seems. No, oh, oh, uh, ooh, lost a little bit of health. Okay, another health back. Perfect. Oh no. Here they come. place is weird and complicated. Okay, Laura, give me some tips as to what to do. Uh, the three towers up against these walls look promising. I need to climb up one of these three towers that are against the walls of this room. To climb one of these three towers that are up against the walls of these, this room. Okay, I don't see three towers. There's one. There's two. Oh, I could use my grapple hook in there. I think. 
Okay, I don't know what to do. Yeah, the man die already. I mean, I can't deal with the spiders, but that's it. One of the towers, I wonder. Okay, I'm up here. Now what? There's nothing here. Is that one of the towers she was talking about? Oh. Oh. Oh, there's another treasure. It's not really. Not really what I was hoping for. Hoping to find. Oh, it's right there. I should. There should be a way to get to the top. Oh, here it is. It was easy. I was right here all this time. Oh no! <laughs> Not that easy because of motherfucker. Damn! Stop aiming! Far! This guy's right here. Kill it! Still alive! I don't know he's dead. I think. It looks kind of alive. Hello? <laughs> it looks kind of alive to me. Oh, there it is. There's a switch. Or what seems to be some sort of mechanism. Hmm. What does that do? There are three top. Oh, it opened the, one of the gates. Okay, so there are three towers. Oh, there's another one right there. How do I get there? Uh, I don't know. I'll figure it out. How do I get out of here? So it's somewhere up there, right? That's what she said. Up there. Uh, well, I would assume she would... Ah, oh, that's how you do it. That's why I was confused. Like, how do I go up there? Aha! Give me that as well. Hmm. Okay, two gates have been opened. I think that's all. And back to the place I was before. Oh my goodness. Another one of those? Come on. Die already. The camera helps. But the camera is not helping. Okay, there are two sides for me to go. Which side is the right one? I think this side here. It's just, just give me something extra. Oh no, I cannot go to that side. Not from here, it seems. Ah! 
What the fuck is that? Damn, are those bats? Weird birds. It's daylight, go to sleep. to go try again two three let's go That's how they wanted to do this. <laughs> it's a weird way to get to that point. Okay. Let's see some progress. Climbing. Oh, I miss talking to Zip and Alistair. I don't know why, but they don't talk here that much. At least this game feels more lonely. I mean, it's less happy than the other one. The other one still felt like an adventure. This one feels heavy. Heavy with mystery, and Laura seems really obsessed more than usual. I think that's the that's the vibe that they wanted to achieve anyway. Even with the name Tomb Raider Underworld, so it's supposed to be, I guess, really dark, dark type of Laura. There's also a Tomb Raider game called Tomb Raider Ange Angel. The Angel of Darkness. Um, as far as I know, it's pretty dark. They try to make it really dark, Laura, but it didn't didn't go very well. It wasn't well received by the critics and the fans and everyone. But I've never played it. I should play it sometime, maybe. Might like it or not. Uh, no. Okay, all that to come here, back to the beginning. Okay, oh no, this is not the beginning. It's a different place. Huh, what does it do? Oh, it raised the hand down. Oh, so I put the, the crystals I found in there. That's what it does, I guess. That makes sense. Okay, how do I get there? How do I get to the hand? Where's the hand? Right there. Hmm. Going back here, and I need to fix the hand first. 
before I move on. Okay, nothing new. We've seen this before. <laughs> That's how we do it. I wasted all that time and it was so freaking simple. Okay, this one is more elaborate. So I guess I would need to... Okay, this one is kind of stuck somewhere. Holding a pole. Mm, okay. So I said it was uh, simple. So I don't know when editing if I'm gonna cut that part. So if you guys don't understand what happens, because I cut a part where I just went back to a different. I just went all the way back, thinking that there was something there and there wasn't anything. So bear that in mind. I don't know which parts of the, the gameplay I'll keep when I'm editing. Some parts are just repetition. So it's not really... Oh, that was too fast. Oh, come on. That, took, that was too fast. Okay, that's problematic. There's got to be another way. Oh, the box. There it is. No, this is not a box, but I call it box because I don't know what to call it. Is this a box? I don't know. English not my first language, so sometimes I don't know. I call it a metal box, right? W would it be a box? I don't know. Someone let me know, please. Come on, I need to see where I'm going. <laughs> uh, it's funny. This game is funny. Gucci now. There it is. You gotta find the right spot. Finally, it took me a while to get this. Oh. All done. Successful. Okay, cool. That took a while. Just gotta find the right spot in there. Hey, don't let go of me. Rude. Kind of 
dangerous, but here I am. some sort of gloves I guess I need to find the other half the other side of the glove right the other hand to open both doors okay but where where should I go I don't think it's down there uh, I don't see anything here either hmm okay let me try again Oh, there you go. I was gonna keep looking forever. Get off of this. Ooh, this is interesting. Oh, it glows. This was here long before the upper temple was added. Proto-Norse runes again. My son, your treasures here and far, this gauntlet's twin, your belt Megingjord, and the mighty Mjolnir, are protected by the dead to keep Jormungandr subdued. But the map's been destroyed, and recently. If one of Thor's gauntlets was here, it's gone now. What's this? Natla, I see your goal and I'm your puppet no longer. Richard James Croft. Father did this. Oh, wow. Oh, JC. Strange. Father never used his middle initial in monograms to avoid confusion with his father. That's where you hid the artifact, you sly old fox. <laughs> now, if I can just make it back to the boat, yeah, let's go back. Okay, so all this work to realize that her father has already been here. Uh, so right now I am stuck here. Um, I don't know where to go. I've died. Oh, just found the place. I was crazy looking for the place. Oh, what is this? Uh, I don't know what that is. Oh, I need to turn this stone somewhere. Okay, what does that do? I can go to the other side. Perfect. Pull it up. Not enough. It's bad. Go back. Is this enough? It should be. Now what I need to do is go on the other side. Jump, 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 jump. Oh. I don't really know what to do actually. <laughs> like a mystery to me. Mm, I don't really know. Where should I go now? Well, technically I could stop here, but then I can't go anywhere, right? Yeah. Maybe go back more. Okay, I want to see What's on? What's in there? Um, no. About now. Stop right here. How did I come here in the first place? That's what I'm wondering. How did I get here? I should 
should be able to return, right? If I got here, I should be able to return. Oh, oh my god, what happened to the camera? I'm telling you, this camera is horrible. <laughs> what are you doing? Come back. Oh, here it is. Okay. Should be able to go back. Okay, where am I trying to go in the first place? Good question. All right, keep turning. Keep pushing. Okay, that's the end of the road. Just from this side. Be able to jump. There she goes. Good girl. Um. Well, I'm simply turning it back to its original place, right? Oh no, that's another, another gate. Yeah, yeah, that's another gate. Okay, I need to turn it a little bit more. Man, this took me a while to figure it out. Damn. But you guys are seeing the cut version with a more linear approach without seeing all my mistakes. So that's better for you guys. Not as exciting to me. I like to just go in, figure it out on the first and second try. All right, so let's go back uh, to the boat. Oh. Careful. And I am Thor no longer, it seems. I wonder how he charged it up again. So that thing is not no longer working. That's interesting. I wonder why. So many spiders. What was I doing? No idea. Sometimes I just jump, 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 jump. I don't really know where I'm going. Whee! Uh, uh, oh, maybe I should dive? That's what it would seem. Nope. Just artifacts. I don't necessarily want them. Okay, I see no way out. Do you guys see a way out? And now that I... That her gauntlet or... Her glove is not working anymore. Where is she going? I don't know. Okay, this is the only path available right now. Oh, there it is. Gotta be patient. Okay. But as Laura said in the other game, um, what did she say? I forgot. <laughs> Waiting is for the patient. So, I'm not that patient. Okay. Thankfully, she has a breather. Oh, she does have doesn't have a breather this time. Shit, Laura, why did you come with that one? She's gonna die. doesn't have a breather. Is that what it's called? A breather? I don't know. I'm just making that word. Making that word up. Okay, we're back to the boat. Find anything? There was a map, but Father destroyed it. Well, the acorn certainly didn't fall very far from the tree. He did it deliberately, to keep the information from Natla. But I'm sure he recorded everything first, and what's more, he found Thor's other gauntlet. Where did he put it? Right under your nose. So is it back in England? Is 
bad where he hit it. But anyway guys, I'm gonna stop here and continue from here next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.